Welcome back to module number 18. This module we look into network management and O&M. O&M stands for operation and management. So let's look into the topic we are going to cover. First, we are going to cover the basic concept of network management and O&M. So we look into some of the theory. Then we look into SNMP fundamental and configuration. SNMP stands for simple network management protocol and finally, uh, we are going to conclude with uh, network management based on Huawei iMaster NCE, which is the current latest management tools from Huawei. So let's look into what is a network management and O&M. Network management and O&M play an important role on a communication network. It ensures that devices work properly and communication network run properly to provide efficient, reliable, and secure communication service. We need the network to be reliable and we want it to be efficient and secure. So we need to have somebody to maintain it. And that somebody is the network administrator. This network administrator need to maintain the servers, the switches, the firewalls. Now, sometimes we also call it as a NE. NE stands for network element. The network element consists of the hardware and the software. Next, we look into basic network management function. There are altogether five functions. The five functions, namely configuration management, performance management, fault management, security management, and accounting management. So let's look into these five functions in order. First, we look into configuration management. So in our O&M, configuration management refer to monitor the network configuration information so that network administrator can generate, query, and modify hardware and software running parameters and conditions and configure services. Here, the administrator need to monitor all the network element configuration. So this is one of the function on the network management function. Second is the performance management. Performance management manage the network performance as is mentioned here. So the network can provide reliable, continuous, and low latency communication capability with as few network resources as possible. Okay, so we need to make sure that the network perform as designed. Then point number three here on the basic management is a fault management. Ensure that the network is always available and rectify fault as soon as possible. So in our network management, we need to make sure that the network is running smoothly. And in the event that there are fault and we can't prevent fault that happen, we must able to rectify the fault. Function number four is security management. Security management protect the network and system from unauthorized access and attack, which is important. You have a good network, you have an efficient network, you also need to have a secure network. And finally, the last function of our network management is an accounting management which record the network resource usage of the user, charges the user, and collect statistics on the network resources usage. This is also important for us to plan for future expansion or for us to look into underutilized resources, especially the WAN link. All right, so I want you to remember these uh, five basic network function, which is configuration management, performance management, fault management, security management, and accounting management. A good network ONM should encompasses all these five functions. Let's look into network management modes. Here we have two modes: a traditional network management and ONM, and a management who are using iMaster NCE based network management and ONM. So first we look into the common where right now we're also using is using web system mode. Here we open a browser using HTTP or HTTPS and we monitor this uh, network element. Then another way for us to monitor or operate the network element is using the command line interface. Command line interface has been around for many, many years. We also can use command line interface to manage all these network elements. Then we also can install a system, and this system is called network management system. In Huawei, the network management system is called eSign. 
and eSight is using SNMP based centralized management. How it works is this manager is going to do a query using SNMP based protocol and you are going to monitor all this network management using this protocol. So these are the common management that currently we are using. We term this as traditional network management. So another way for us to monitor modern network is using iMaster NCE. iMaster NCE is Huawei management tools to monitor, operate, control modern network. So iMaster NC is an application that can run on cloud platform. You also can install in on-prem server. It allows you to monitor the data center, campus, WAN, and branches. So instead of using SNMP as in the traditional, in the iMaster NCE, we are using NetConf or the full name is called Network Configuration Protocol. So Huawei iMaster NCE consists of the management, the analysis module, the control, and all these are being incorporated using artificial intelligence. And iMaster NCE also have a rich northbound API or application programming interface that can integrate with commercial application, which include ERP, video conferencing, office operating system and advertisement operation. So there's a lot of application that can integrate with iMaster NCE.